What's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm an audio engineer and a musician of a few years now. And today I'm going to show you a guide and some tips to record a clear voice with Audacity here. All right, now first I want to recommend using a condenser microphone and a large condenser microphone because that's going to capture the full frequency range that we can hear, um, which is 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz. All right. And then from there, we want to use a microphone cable like so. And of course, you want to connect that to your mic. And then you want to plug in the microphone into an audio interface like this so it can capture the clearest signal possible. OK. Now, one tip I'm going to show you or tell you is you want to deaden the room somehow. And I recommend using acoustic foams much like the acoustic foam I have up here, it deadens the room a little bit so the sound doesn't bounce off the walls so much. You know how you hear that echo when you record or when people speak, especially in the bathroom because there's so much hard surfaces. So if you put up something soft or some foam or you can try and be creative with it, um, definitely deaden the sound that way there's not so much sound bouncing around the room and you can record a clear voice. But let's go ahead and set up uh, our rig here so we can record the vocal. So let's go into Audacity here and really quickly just set up the inputs and outputs. So for the input, we just want to cruise up over here where the microphone is and we want to select the correct audio interface. And like I showed you earlier, I was using the Sapphire 6 USB. Of course, you want to use whatever interface you're using. And then you want to select how many inputs or how many tracks you're going to be recording. But since it's just voice, it's just usually one. So we want to select one and double check that's correct. And then we want to make sure our outputs are OK. So here you want to find the speaker icon here. And then you want to select from the choices. And usually you want to go out of the same audio interface, which is Sapphire 6 USB. But for my rig, I'm using a, a different output, which is called Soundflower. All right. And that's pretty much it to record a clear voice inside of Audacity. If you do have any other questions, please let us know. And thank you for watching.